everyone. Welcome back to Yoga Song. My name is Hyun. Today we will have a very effective core strengthening yoga workout for your beautiful and healthy body. Once you're ready, find a squat position. Feet about your hip knees apart, toes slightly out, heels in. And you can do some half squat. Bend your knees and extend your leg out. Slightly diagonally extend your leg out. And again, squat halfway, the other leg extended. All right, take it slow. Bend your knees, hips back and down, and lift one of your legs back, down, stretch your leg. So it looks like this, when you bend your knees, hips back, when you extend your leg, keep the leg nice and long. Lower, extend it out. Alternate the side, find your own range of motion, Feel the strength and stretch in your hips. Lower. Keep the back nice and long. Activate your core muscle. One more each side. Squeeze, squeeze. All right, release. Inhale, extend your arms up. Slowly, carefully release your hands down on your mat. Make your way to downward facing dog. Take your time. Stretch your legs, your back, and you might lift your hips a little bit higher. Stretch your shoulders as well. Take one breath here. Inhale. Exhale, let it go. When you bend your knees, slowly take your knees down for tabletop. And bring your knees together, feet touch. Now extend your right leg back, left hand forward, both dog pose. Left hand down, right knee down, left leg out, right hand forward, alternate the side again. Back to tabletop, extend opposite leg and arm with a control. Inhale, exit, stretch your leg and arm. Stay focused on your body, keeping your core super tight. Hug your belly in toward your back all the time. Inhale, exhale, stretch out. One more each side. Good. Once you're done, release your elbows down, forearm down for elbow plank. Option one, you can adjust your knee, knee slightly back and move your hips side to side, supported rainbow elbow plank. For those who can have a little more advanced pose, you can lift your knees up and do the same thing. Sway your hips side to side. So always choose whatever works in your body. Respect your body, your energy level today. 10 more seconds. There's no good or bad or right and wrong. Listen to your body. Again, stay focused. One more breath here. Good, release. Everyone, belly down, chest down. Next up, Superman pose. You extend your arms out and front. And you're gonna extend your legs out. Inhale here. Exhale, lift your hands and feet at the same time. Up and down. Inhale, exhale, lift. Make sure your core is super tight to support your lower back when you lift your hands and feet. Inhale, keep the legs and arms nice and firm. Inhale, exhale, lift and stretch. All right, three, Two, doesn't need to be super high. Just feel the length and strength in your body. If it lasts one, hold for three. Two, maybe, maybe not a little bit higher. One, and release. Okay, take your hands by your side. Tuck your toes under. Press up the plank. Holding your plank, hug your belly in, shoulders over your wrists. Keep the core engaged. Option one, stay here. Option two, mountain climber, knee to chest. 
chest away from your mat. You got this. 15 seconds. Exhale, hug your belly in. Lengthen through your neck. Last breath here. And release. Take your knees down, rest for a moment, hips down toward your heels, relax your neck and shoulders. Child pose of your choice. One more deep inhale. Deserve the exhale. All right, find your comfortable seated. And then you're gonna do some twists. One of your legs out, bend the other knee. Knee over your ankle and take the elbow, opposite elbow to outer knee for spider twist. If it is ever too much, you can just hold your knee. Okay. Lengthen through your back. You might look back. Stay for three, two. Keep the core engaged. One. And release the other side. Find your own shape to stretch, to open, or let go, whatever that means to you. One more deep inhale, spine long, exhale, twist. Back to center, shake your legs, shake your hands, good. Inhale, reach your hands up. As you exhale, hinge from your hips, hands forward. Maybe you can stay halfway or hands down on your legs or mat. Inhale, exhale, chest forward. Feel the stretch through the back side of the leg. Stay for three. Relax your neck and shoulders. Two. Just feel what you feel through your body. One more. You're done. Good job. Find your comfortable seated finally. <laughs> Inhale, extend your arms up. As you exhale, one of your hands down, lengthen through your side of body. Inhale, back to center. The other side. Some of you might feel some tension in your neck. Then you can bend your elbows, open up the chest, and hands by your head or behind you. Inhale, lift your chest up, look up, chin up. Exhale, chin down. Relax the back side of the neck. Twice more. Inhale, open up the chest. Exhale, relax. Breathe in. Chin down. Keep your head nice and happy. Stay there for three, two, one. Release one of your hand against your head. Press gently for lengthening, opening, stretching your side of neck. Slow down your breath. Back to center, switch. Keep your eyes nice and soft. Let your face be soft and relaxed too. Okay. Join both palms together using your thumbs. Just stretch your front leg for the last. Lift your chin. Maybe hug your elbows in. One inhale here. One exhale. Right, how do you feel? <laughs> I feel good. <laughs> Actually, I was a little uh, sad, <laughs> a little bit down uh, for the couple of days, the last couple of days, but I feel much better now. So thank you for your support. No matter how you feel today, remember you are the first and there's no right and wrong in your emotion. Just respect, accept whatever comes up in your body, in your mind, in your present moment. 
Hope you like this practice and let me know how you feel after practice. All right, stay tuned, stay healthy and strong, happy. <laughs> Hope to see you soon. Namaste.